Hello there, my name is Richard Spate and I'm the project manager for DigiSkills Cymru, a Wales Union Learning Fund project created by Unison, hosted by Adult Learning Wales and funded by the Welsh Government. DigiSkills Cymru has created and developed a groundbreaking new one-day accredited course that gives Welsh public service workers the opportunity to become upstanders against bullying and violence that has become such a problem in the online world. I'm sorry that I'm not able to be with you today. I'm, I'm based in Bangor and it's a long way for me to travel down to Cardiff uh, to give this kind of presentation. So I've recorded this video especially for you. So let's start with some background. In March 2016, I designed and delivered a one-day social media awareness course for Unison's Regional Women's Committee. It was really well received and I was invited uh, to think about what could be offered as a follow-up. Um, to members and, and activists. Um, so working closely with Jane Gebby from the, the committee and area organiser Jenny Griffin and Ados Kadoli on Cymru, Adult Learning Wales tutor Zoe Moore, I co-designed a new highly interactive course that formed the centre of a whole day of action to mark the UN International Day for the Elimination of Violence Against Women that we held in Cardiff on the, um, the Day of Action on the 25th of November 2016. The Combating Cyber Violence and Online Bullying course is now available to you and other groups, fully funded until the end of March 2017. Although it was created with the issues that many women activists face online at its core, um, it's not restricted to women uh, or to Unison members. I'm going to briefly run through some of the main points of the course. So the course was based on um, an accredited a Godhead Cymru unit called Understanding Cyberbullying. This covers the definition and forms of cyberbullying, the effects of cyberbullying, identifying sources of support and how to safeguard against and record instances of cyberbullying. Learners who achieve against these criteria will receive a formal certificate from a Godhead Cymru through Adult Learning Wales. The course also uses the Open Badge Academy online system to allow learners to record their learning digitally and receive a digital badge to recognise their achievement. Here is the badge and here is how it appears on the um, Open Badge Academy website. You can see um, there are several tasks for learners to complete. You upload evidence to each task and receive uh, feedback directly. Uh, from the tutor for each of the tasks. The system also allows uh, learners to develop their wider digital skills while hopefully not getting in the way of the learning itself. The course starts by looking at the nature and scale of the problem with a video from BBC Newsnight's Shame Season highlighting that the problem of online violence can go well beyond trolling on social media and extends deep into a person's offline relationships. We also consider some of the shocking statistics around the scale of abuse of women uh, that people face on social networks like Twitter. Learners then work in groups to complete a number of tasks, looking firstly at the definition of cyber violence and online bullying and the different forms it takes. We hear Monica Lewinsky's powerful TED talk where she shares her account of being the first survivor of online abuse back in the 1990s. And with this in mind, we move on to look at some of the emotions associated with online bullying and the effects it can have upon someone's work, home life and well-being. After lunch, groups then complete a discovery task where they search for, share and review a range of sources of help and support that are available online relating to cyber violence and online bullying such as BBC Webwise and they do this using a, an online form uh, through Google Docs. The learners use these resources to then discuss and share the safeguarding features and methods available to keep people safe using common social networking tools like Facebook and Twitter, through the settings on different mobile smartphones, 
and on email and chat room forums. Much of this centres on understanding the nature of the different apps, websites and devices. This then leads on to an ideas sharing group brainstorming session where learners discuss ways of recalling instances of cyber violence and online bullying. Finally, at the end of the day, the learners are encouraged to think about innovative ways that they as public service workers and activists might work together to combat cyber violence. So that's the course. It lasts a whole day and we try to make it as highly interactive and interesting as possible. If you can get a group of six learners together in a nice room with decent Wi-Fi connection before the end of March, then we'll try our hardest to organise and deliver the course for you in partnership with Adult Learning Wheels. We can even help with finding and paying for an external venue if this is needed. So please contact either me or Jenny Griffin at Unison in Cardiff and we'll help you with this. Thank you very much and enjoy the rest of your meeting.